to this is going to be a vlog today. Um, I'm going to film this over the course of a few days, but I wanted to I wanted to start here um, because I just want to start here. <laughs> Um, I'll show you my outfit of the day in a, in a second. I'll show you that. But I wanted to talk you through... Man, my husband is loud. Give me a second. So I wanted to talk you through some of the things I have planned for today and then for the next you know few days as we go through this vlog. But um, before we do all of that, we are definitely going to be... Um, I, I have some things I want to show you. I had done a couple of hauls that were pretty intense. It was a lot of things that I shared with you on those hauls. Um, um, and you would think that I would have absolutely nothing left to show. I do. I have a few knickknacks that I want to share with you. So I'm going to go ahead and go into another room and start to share those things with you. I, it's literally just a, a few things and hopefully you find them interesting, but literally just a few things. And then we'll go ahead and kind of get on with things. Okay, as for my outfit of the day, um, I think you've seen all of these things, to be honest. Um... I think maybe, I don't even know what you haven't seen. I think you've been with me long enough to have seen all of these pieces. The jacket that I'm wearing is um, one from Nordstrom. It's a halogen brand, one of their own brands. And if you remember, I went through this phase and I still have this mental phase where I'm loving Balmain and the Balmain blazer, but I'm not loving the Balmain blazer price. So I have bought, you know, I purchased a couple of blazers where I've refashioned the buttons to look Balmain-esque. And that's what these are. These are like silver buttons on this pink blazer, this sort of oversized pink blazer to look like the main brand, but <laughs> it is not. And then underneath I just have just a plain, um, uh, really comfy tee from The Gap that has silver lines kind of uh, going through it. The necklace I got, I can't even remember where I got it from. I really wish I knew where I got it from. But it is um, a personalized necklace um, that says Suge's wife. Um, Suge is my husband's nickname, so it says Suge's wife on it. I thought that was really cute. And then um, I got this Timberland belt. The pants here, I literally just hauled and showed it to you. I got these jeans for $7.99 in the Zara sale. Um, they're sort of oversized, cropped, um, high-waisted, all of the things. And uh, like stonewashed or acid washed, not acid washed, like stonewashed. So very reminiscent of 80s slash 90s style. And then um, as for the shoes, you saw me haul these last year as well. Um, these are something navy these white boots <laughs> and so that is my outfit of the day but before I move on I do want to show you a few knickknacks that I've been picking up along the way and then again like I said I'm going to be doing this vlog across a few days and kind of taking you along on a few things so um, the next thing I want to show you is this really cool thing I saw a youtuber um, talking about stacking necklaces in an, in a, in an, and an efficient way to do that she found I don't even know what were these calls again um cookies <laughs> I don't remember I'll, I'll pop them in the description box below but um it's like this little you know I'll bring it up a little closer and probably do a cutaway as well but it's a little clasp here that allows you to hook together several necklaces um it came eight in a pack and you can do two, three, four, and five necklaces I think it is and for those of you who love to stack necklaces you know they tangle but this one keeps them all separated. And if you want to keep the stack intact, right, all you have to do is take the little thing apart. And you can just, you know, take it off for the day, put it back on, and they're still stacked the way that they were the day before. I thought this was a pretty cool idea. I do like to stack necklaces, and I do find that they tangle, and I don't even want to be bothered with it. So I thought this was really cool. And again, it comes in like a, a package here, a, little, um, a pouch here, and then it comes in a set of eight. So you get the connector, you get the actual apparatus, I forget what they're called, hookers? I'm not, I don't know what they're called. Um, but then it also comes with like little um, uh, little hooks and stuff like that. These are so small, but um, I cut away. You'll be able to see them. It comes with the hook so that you can hook them around on the little apparatus itself. <laughs> so I don't know the name of it, but I thought that was really ingenious. And so I did pick that up so I could stack my necklaces. And if you're really into stacking necklaces and you feel like it's just difficult to keep them arranged, this is your answer. Yep, I'm, 
I'm hooking you up and putting you on to the game. So the next thing I want to show you is um, a coat. I was looking at this coat and I don't even need a coat. I have so many coats. I probably need to show you my coat collection one of these days. But I have a lot of coats, but this one was so, so pretty. I'll do a cutaway. Um, I saw this coat, I think it's a halogen coat from um, Nordstrom, and it was always a little bit more than I'm willing to pay for a coat that doesn't have any, just isn't that special. I mean, in terms of the materials, wasn't that special. But I love the color and the design. So I've been eyeballing it, hoping the price would go down, and it has gone down, but still not enough. I think the original price was 168 it went down to 200 Still not what I'm willing to pay for that coat. So happened, I went to Nordstrom Rack when they were still having the sale that I was telling you about and I totally, um, actually no, this was a different sale, it was a special sale. They were only having a sale on winter items. So coats, hats, scarves, accessories like that and sweaters were all an additional 50% off red tag and purple tag. So I ambled on in there, had nothing in mind that I wanted, but of course I'm gonna check out a sale if you tell me there's a sale. And I found something very similar, higher end even, and way cheaper. So I found this Trina Turk version of the coat. Um, the colors are probably not as crazy bright as the one um, that uh, Halogen has, which is great because this is actually a more mature version of that color. But this is a Trina Turk, it's faux fur and it is super, super soft. It's less teddy bear than the other one, but it's so, so nice. The original price on this coat was $245. I ended up got, getting it for $22.50. So I think I did better. It's not a, um, the other one was what, like a three quarter length. So um, above the ankle, um, but pretty long. This one hits me just below the knee. So this one is not as long as the other one either. But as, again, it, it checks the box in terms of unique, new, unique style. The same amount of warmth. Um, the color arrangement, you know, is similar, but this one's higher end and nicer, more uh, higher quality and cheaper. So definitely a good find. I wasn't even on the, you know, looking for this, but I remembered that I loved it and I picked this up. The next couple of items that I got are from um, just randomly picking them up. I was at um, a party. I went to a party. I forgot to tell you guys. I actually got out of the house and went to a party. I've gone to two parties in the last, I want to say, month, month and a half. So I'm getting out and doing things. But um, on my way out, there was a stand that was selling some really cute items. I did pick up this brooch or pin or whatever we want to call it that says, um, we love house music. And I'll do a cutaway on this too so you can see it. Um, but it does say, we love house music. This is um, and the cool thing about this is that the we heart house and the music symbol glows in the dark. So definitely the next time I go out dancing and you know it's going to be dark, I'm going to be rocking this pin, probably on a very, you know, like a really plain shirt, like a black shirt, t-shirt or something like that with this pin. And you'll see the we heart house and music, um, glowing in the dark. I'm super excited about that. Then I also picked up because I love that symbol so much. I picked up a t-shirt. They didn't have the t-shirt in my size at the time. And so, oh cute, they gave me some stickers. EvolveChicago.com is the brand. They gave me a couple of stickers here. Um, this one looks like the Chicago flag, but it also says we love house music. So I'm definitely gonna probably stick that on my laptop or something. And this is their brand. Um, but I got this t-shirt that has the same symbol that you've seen on that sticker and on that brooch. So definitely gonna probably make an appearance on one of these videos. You guys know I love to wear these little message and image tees here, these graphic tees. So um, shout out to Evolve Chicago. They definitely came through in sending me the shirt that I wanted, so thank you. And the last items that I got took over a month to get here. They're not even all that special, but um, as you guys know, I still do carry a BlackBerry mobile phone. I do. <laughs> um, I will be sure to turn off the lights when I leave. But um, I always like to do fun cases. These cases are nowhere near as fun as all the options that the Android and Apple users have. But it still serves the purpose that I need. These are leather cases that have... Um, 
that have little slots inside for your card and your your cards and your money. So I love these book style cases for my phone. So let's let's let let me show you what it looks like. Definitely an old woman accessory. So inside, obviously, this is where your phone would go, and then it has the slots here for your cards, and then it has a um, area here for your cash. So I love these, and I love to switch these up uh, with the season. The one that I have on right now is pink, kind of matches my outfit today. So now I have a red and a pink um, and a light blue. I think I'm gonna definitely go with the red next because we're still in, you know, sort of the winter months. And then for summer, I'm gonna switch to the pastel blue. All right, so that's all for the little haul that I'm doing right now. I am about to go and get a massage. I am in serious need for um, a massage right now. I have been feeling a little bit drab lately. Um, probably can tell, <laughs> probably can tell. I'm feeling a little bit drab. It's probably because it's just, we're, it's not summer yet. And I'm just trying to get there. I'm trying to get there mentally, man. And this is that time of year where you just kind of can't take it anymore so anyway um that's where i am right now i'm gonna probably go get a massage um maybe i will take you with and then we'll continue on into the weekend this weekend we're supposed to have excellent weather so that makes for great trips for us so let's see what we have in store coming right back i am headed to get a massage and that's what we're doing Hopefully, I'll be able to find a parking space. I'm already late. I'm just late for life. I'm always late. But hopefully, I'll be able to park, park, find a parking space where I normally go. And I'll show it to you. Because if you're in Chicago, maybe you'll want to enjoy it. But where I normally go, there's most of the areas I rest have restricted parking during business hours. Which is dumb because... What about the businesses over there? How, how are people supposed to patronize the businesses if you can't park? So, we'll see what happens. Hmm. Feels nice. So, once I get there, I'll show you the place. But for now, you don't need to watch me driving. Okay, I was in a rush and was running to go and get into the spa. So, I didn't get a chance to take you. But, um... The name of the place is called Healthy Zoo Spa on, let's say, Randolph and Halstead. Yeah, Randolph and Halstead. And I come here because they do an excellent job for one, but the prices are even better. Um, I normally get the 90-minute massage, and a 90-minute massage is $50. I don't know where else they do that at, but they do that here, Healthy Zoo Spa. I'm actually pretty cold. Um, I think you guys might remember this coat. I hauled it last year during the uh, Nordstrom anniversary sale. Got a really good deal on this one too. I got a good deal on mostly everything that I buy. Um, anyway, I am shaking like a leaf because I am cold and I can't hold this thing right. So I am going to try to find something to eat. I have a meeting that I have to uh, join at about in a couple hours so um, I need to hurry up and find what I'm going to eat for dinner and be ready for this meeting so so I stopped at the container store to get one of these clothes flippy foldy thingies um, I'm going to attempt to clean my closet I have so much shit in my closet and I can't even move around in there, so I have to purge and fold and put things away. And this is this is my feeble attempt to get started. I had one and I broke it, and so that started my downward spiral. So here we go. So this is my outfit of the day. I am wearing. You guys have seen this before. <clears throat> you saw when I bought this a long time ago. It's a fila cropped um, sweatshirt top. But, um, and I've styled it on several styling videos, but the funny thing about it is I've never worn this before. So I thought I had, I really in my head thought I had, but when I pulled it out of the closet, the tags were still hanging here this morning. So this is my first time wearing this and it's super cute. Um, I got this, actually, I got this outfit idea from another 
I don't know where I got it from. I just remember seeing it online somewhere. So it was either, you know, in style inspiration or another YouTuber or influencer that put together a cropped um, sweatshirt like this. And then a, like a little skater skirt like this or hoop skirt, skater skirt like this with with some boots. So today I decided to do my Fila cropped sweatshirt. This is a Lush skirt. The brand is called Lush and they carry it in um, Nordstrom. And then I have on my AGL um, combat boots, which you guys have seen a million and one times at this point. I wear these all the time, every day, all day. Love, love, love these. So um, that's my outfit. And for those of you who are not aware, I am in Chicago. So it is still winter here, <laughs> even though it should be like spring, but it is still winter here. I'm going to throw on some um, sweatpants over this so I can make it into the office and not freeze to death. But um, yeah, so this is today's outfit of the day oh yeah let's see uh yeah so you could see that season comparison i know i always <laughs> show you guys um myself i'm trying to get this in the good view but yeah so how tall are you five eight and a half okay so five eight five feet so that's the difference so i never have anybody else in my videos with me now you can see somebody else in my video so we're headed out we're gonna do brunch i might show you what we're eating and I'll definitely show you a little bit of the shopping, but we'll see you later. It's here. I got a veggie. I got a veggie scramble and um, potatoes, I guess. We got the red velvet French toast. I'm so excited about this. Did they give us syrup? No. Do you think we need syrup? No. <laughs> um, and what do you have? Uh, I think it's called... It's basically some gravy. I don't remember. It's, it's farmhouse. Food. Farmhouse. Farmhouse. Some food and, and drinks, drinks, which I don't like. And she drinks coffee. <laughs> All right, we'll let you know how this works out. All right, what we got here? <laughs> We're gonna see if we can get her in a dress today. I don't know if that's gonna happen. Look at these prices. 20 bucks. Not bad. For Urban Outfitters, not bad at all, right? So we're in the Urban Outfitters surplus store. And this is her first time here. I come here all the time. You guys know that. So, so we're here. <laughs> all right, we're going to try to get her in a dress today. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. All right, if the price is right, I'm, sur I'm sure I'll get her to try it on at least. But the cool thing about today is that they have a sale going on, 50% off all winter accessories. I'm not sure exactly what that means. Maybe just had some scars, but we'll find out. But I'll show you what we get. Pretty sure that I have convinced my niece to put on some dresses. So hopefully I can get her to let me show you what it looks like. But I'm about to try on some things too. Um, and I'll haul them later. I'm not going to put you through this long, long video and have you see everything that I try on. I'm going to haul it for you um, and do sort of let you see what all that looks like later but that's my stack for now there are like nine pieces here we'll see what I pick but it's cute though the color is great with her complexion I can't breathe right now she can't breathe but we're gonna size up and she's gonna get it it's a dollar so can't can't go wrong with that I like it so we're in Nordstrom Rack and here's my here's my dilemma I see these shoes they're super cute Right, and I but the thing is, I have Nikes. You guys saw these before. I have Nikes that look just like this. Here's the challenge, though I have to make the decision now. They're currently on sale, <laughs> they're currently on sale at um, Nordstrom, so for $680. So it's not even like I'd be getting a deal. It's not there. They're not even like really clearance things. So I have to make a decision. Break. We are in the Bloomingdale's Mall. I don't even know what this is, but Bloomingdale's is the anchor here on the Magnificent Mile here on Michigan Avenue. And we are taking a break. Her with her Garrett's popcorn. <laughs> um, and it's really nice. I have to show you the um, view here. Let me show it to you. I don't know if you can see this. Let me darken it a bit. Look at that. 
The sky is gorgeous today. So this is Michigan Avenue. That's Lake Michigan. But that's the view. This place is pretty nice. This is a little lounge here at the top called Astor Hall. And look how plush these chairs are. That's what I'm chilling. But this is nice. <laughs> We're at the signature room. Well, the lounge. We're here on the 96th floor of the Hancock building. This is her first time here. Um, I've been here a few times before, but I'm going to show you guys the view in a minute. But we're having a good time. We're just seeing Chicago from a tourist. I live here. So <laughs> she's being a tourist. But the signature room is somewhere you should stop by if you're here. Definitely get a different view of the city. You're way up 96 floors. The city is so much better. So much different. What do you think? Are you nervous up here? Uh, I'm not nervous because I'm not that close to the uh, window like on the edge, but I think if I looked over the edge, I'd probably just take a couple shots. So I'm thinking we're not taking selfies by the way. I mean, I can't be scared of humans. I know I'm going to fall. Alright, so I was just going to show you the gear in a second. Oh, are you going to lose the ball? All right, so the day is over. Um, there was <laughs> there was so much more that happened after all of the vlogging that I showed you, but my phone decided to rebel against me. It died. So after the um, after the signature room at the Hancock Building, we went to get many petties. Well, not many. I didn't get a many. I got a petty. My niece got a, a Manny, which was super cute. I wanted to show it to you. Then we went out for dinner, and I couldn't show you that, and it was really, really good dinner. <laughs> so um, it was a really great night. I mean, great day. Great to spend time with my niece. I don't get to do that very often, so it's really nice to do that all day. Um, but hopefully you enjoyed that. I had um, a lot of cool things that I hauled, and I'm going to show you that in another video because this video is extremely long. I haven't even edited it yet, and I know that it's going to be extremely long. So I won't even do that to you. So I'm going to film another video to show you the things that I hauled from my day out with my niece. And um, hopefully you enjoyed this. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button right there. And share it with your friends. Hit the like button. Comment down below. Let me know what you really enjoyed about this video. Let me know if you have any questions about anything that we did. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.